Hello, I am Nimja, and this is only a costume. There are many reasons why we dress up, especially in costumes, often to be something different than what we are normally, a moment where we can pretend to be someone or something else. It allows us to hide behind a facade of something outside of us. Colors, costumes, fabrics, and fascinating little details that distract from normality and allow us to live in a world of fantastical creations. And of course there are moments when these creations come together, like at a costume party, where you can step outside of your normal self and dress up for whatever reason. Some people spend many hours or days on their costume, while others just throw something silly together that they had already anyway. Whichever it is for you, this time, this party has someone walking around in a more curious costume. I'm sure you could imagine like all the different ways that people dress up. Generally, however, it doesn't go as far as an almost operatic level of detail. Some kind of Victorian clothes with those muted colors, those pretty elegant patterns, and of course a big cloak. Something about this person is shouting, telling, I am a hypnotist. You can even tell that they are carrying a pocket watch visible in the front. They must have spent quite some time on that costume. And they are simply standing in a corner looking at the people around. There is a moment when your eyes lock, they've noticed you. Of course, it's a party and you're welcome to talk to anyone, and at least this one is a little more interesting than the rest right now, even though they're only dressed up it can still create some kind of interesting conversation. So allow yourself to imagine, basically letting the other people fade away for a moment and focusing on this conversation. Asking what they are supposed to be and Getting the answer that you already knew, they are a powerful hypnotist. They are able to take away your mind and make you do their bidding. Muhahaha. Of course. At the same time, though, there is a smile. The more curious you get, the closer you stand. You notice that their voice is beginning to get a little more intimate, more close. They tell you that they actually spent some effort into finding a pocket watch which would be perfect 
for the costume. And in fact, it is a very pretty, fascinating pocket watch. You can look right through it, seeing all the little gears tick and tock as you watch the watch being swung from left to right and right to left. Obviously, this is only a costume, so you wouldn't fall into trance with something as simple as a pocket watch being swung in front of you, wouldn't you? The pretty edges, the filigree, the brass sheen glimmering in the light as your eyes try to follow the watch, swinging side to side, looking, watching, following and feeling your eyes lock onto it almost automatically. It is so fascinating to look at, isn't it? So easy to focus all of your mind on the simple shape as you watch the watch, pulling down your thoughts. And when I let the watch drop into my hand, so do your eyelids fall with it and your thoughts as well. It is only a costume after all, there would be no reason for you to fall into an ever deepening state of trance now would there? So go ahead and open your eyes and notice that not only did I bring a pocket watch with me, I also have this pendant. Now some say that this is a magical pendant, imbued with powers to simply pull your thoughts away by the mere action of having you stare at its twinkling, twisting shape. The sparkles shimmering in the light and drawing in your eyes, your mind, your thoughts, with just a few seconds of exposure, you'd be completely under its control. All nonsense, of course, this is merely a costume, and I'm sure that you are not mindlessly staring at this non-existent pendant being slowly swung in front of your eyes. I wonder if you can feel your body beginning to sway with the motions of the pendant. Did you notice that you also gently rocked side to side when you were watching the watch? Letting your will slip away as you willingly slip away into a drifting state of emptiness. As the pretty facets fascinate your mind and set a new moment of blankness for the moment. As you imagine yourself being taken away into a blissful cloud of wonderful hypnotic blankness. They could simply let the pendant drop, with your mind going blank just as much, falling into their hands being caught and guided. And even though it is only a costume, you can never be sure who it is beneath. Are they dressed up as a hypnotist? 
or was it a hypnotist dressed up as something else? As your mind may consider these words melting into fantasies that flutter and drift deeper into your mind. It is already too late to consider. You are in a trance, and all it takes right now is thinking of how nice it was to watch and draw with such simple sensations. This file will end, but the adventure will continue. If my voice follows, you might be taken for an ever deepening ride of wonderful hypnotic sensations. Otherwise, if my voice doesn't follow, you'll find yourself blinkingly waking up. Perhaps being confused for a moment. Just like right now when there's a pause and you feel yourself waking up just a little. Seeing perhaps the pendant, maybe the watch, as you watch yourself dropping further down again. It is only a costume. But who knows what lies underneath. Enjoy the sensations of slipping further and further away as you let this costumed hypnotist entrance you even more, allowing yourself to fall, spiraling down Watching, swaying, rocking, dropping, drifting. Enjoy as the journey continues.